everything costs more today. Inflation has really slaughtered us. And one thing that seems to be going up is the price of energy. So I've asked my friend, Bob Muller from Personal Plumbing, to join me here on the program. Hey, Bob, how are you? Doing great, Joe. Thanks for having me. So I'm thinking of ways my listeners can save some money in the home. Is it on their air conditioning or their heating? Is it on their mortgage? Is it on eating, you know, less finer foods? But let's talk about, you know, let's talk about the the plumbing in the home, okay? Think about what's going on and what costs money. And when you think about it, it costs a fair amount of money to heat the water. And since you're in the plumbing business and you install water heaters, I thought I'd ask you, is there a way for people to save money and become more energy efficient with getting a new water heater? The answer to that is absolutely. Um, I, it, on all of your products that you purchase, so if it's regular, just a basic regular water heater that's non-energy efficient, which doesn't have maybe the Energy Star label on it, um, those appliances are known to be less efficient. So they're not going to give you the type of savings that you would normally get from a more efficient one, but even those products are more efficient today than our older products from before. So the short answer to that is yes, you will get better energy uh, efficiency on those products, but you can get even better efficiency ratings on more advanced products like your Energy Star rated uh, products, which have usually condensing type systems like a tankless water heater, uh, more of a direct vented type uh, tank water heater, there's more efficient ones that are out there. They obviously cost a little bit more to uh, purchase up front, but the energy savings that you can get from them are tremendous. The other side to that is because we do so much solar here, um, there is other uh, water heaters out there on the, on the market today called our heat pump technology water heaters that would be combined with your solar. These are electric water heaters, but they're a heat pump first. So they will, they will uh, use your uh, garage's heat to be the first source of your of your uh, water um, heating portion of it, kind of like a refrigerator. And then as it needs the energy, it will suck the energy from the solar panels. So you can have one of these type of water heaters installed and it would cost you absolutely nothing to run your, your uh, water heater. That is fantastic. Wow. So to find out more, contact Bob. All of his contact information is in the description of this podcast. Thanks, Bob. Appreciate your advice and your expertise on this. Thanks, Joe. Appreciate it.